Talks aimed at resolving days of border clashes between Sudan and South Sudan forces have been delayed with the two sides pledging not to allow the conflict to escalate into a full-blown war. The talks to be held under the auspice of the African Union in Addis Ababa, the Ethiopian capital, were delayed because the chief mediator, Thabo Mbeki, had not yet arrived. South Sudan chief negotiator Pagan Amum says the aim of the talks is to pursue peace and prevent an escalation of hostilities into a fully-fledged war. We will not cross into the Republic of Sudan, but we will protect our territorial integrity. We know that there are outstanding issues which are remaining, which we believe the duty of the African Union High Implementation Panel, led by President Mbeki, should be in a position to resolve these issues. Sudanese President Omar al-Bashir told an Arab League summit on Thursday that Khartoum wants good relations with the newly independent South. Both sides have accused each other of starting the fighting near the Heglig oil field. The worst violence in South Sudan declared independence from Khartoum last July after decades of civil war. South Sudan says northern bombers and troops had struck fast on Monday, moving into Unity State before southern troops fought back and took the Heglig oil field, parts of which are claimed by both countries. Our position is very clear. We will not be dragged into the war. Our president has said that. But we will defend the territorial integrity of our country. That we will not allow anybody to infringe on it. The South Sudan delegation led by Office of the President, Minister Emmanuel Lovila, and Information Minister Dr. Banada Mariala is asking Kenya to mediate in the search for peace between Judah and Khartoum. For Newsnight, I'm Shem Oluchiri.